all this work that we're doing brothers for this ministry eventually is going to pay off you better believe it man it's going to pay off like you'll never believe okay and by the way we're the highest value male on this planet the men of the lord the men of this truth the hopeful elect of yahweh bashim yahushai the highest value male there is I'ma walk down when I can't not. I'ma walk down when I can't take. I'ma walk down. I'm walk down. Hey man, free with Z5, man, free Z9, man, free Z7, man. free holiday, man. Free holiday, man. Free Duke, man. I'm talking about holiday, bro. What the fuck you saying? I ain't gonna be out there. I ain't gonna be out there. I ain't gonna be out there. You feel me? What is you saying? Act right, now. Act right. Act like folk, now. At like folk. At like folk, man. At like folk, man. We got two on tonight. 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 We uh -huh. yeah. I'm gonna walk down when I can't not. I'm gonna walk. So, one. First and foremost, I would like to give all praise and glory unto Yahweh. By Hashem Yahweh Shah, by Hashem Kakwadash. Double honors unto the apostles and the elders of GMS who rule well, teach well, being great examples to his younger brothers in peace and blessings, salutations, and hopeful like out there pushing his word and truth. And it's a series across the four winds in the name of Yahweh Bashim Al Shah. Pushing to get up out of here. Shalom on to the whole flag, the believers, the listeners who may have came back to the obedience of the scriptures through faith in Yahweh Bashim Al Shah. Alright, and what I want to go into this morning is just ask the simple question What's the point of it all? You know, it's got to the point to where, you know, the culture that our people indulge in, what sense does it make? You know? Like what? What? What is the point of this? You know, there's a bunch of niggas with guns waiting on other niggas with guns, and whoever shoot first, you know, just, I mean, like, what's what's the point of all of this, man? Okay, nigga culture, all right, has become so dark, all right, so stupid. Okay, they it doesn't even make sense. All right. And then in 2023, all right, this this mindset that dominates, okay, our people, you know, it doesn't even make sense. Cause guess what? All these niggas you see, all right, they probably got baby mamas, and they done duplicated themselves two or three times, okay. And then and and this gonna remain a culture. That's why the Lord has has just got to put it in. Okay, to this society, man. That's why the Lord is just going to come with swift destruction, man. All right, this is a culture that doesn't even make sense. Okay, now let's go here because the scriptures go into these things. All right, let's get um the book of Isaiah 51 and 20. It says, Thy sons have fainted, they lie. Okay. At the head of every street, as a wild bull in a net, they are full of the fury of the Lord, the rebuke of thy power. Okay, and this is the result of us, you know, being disobedient to our power. The Lord, you know, allow our people just to continue to become more and more degenerate. Each generation is worse. Okay, each few years it gets worse. Our people are constantly in the state of what degenerate, and the scriptures say going backwards. Okay, <laughs> what 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 culture is this, man? You see what sense what sense it does it make? <laughs> Finish, man. Let's read verse eighteen, Isaiah fifty one and eighteen. Um, I start at 17 it says awake awake stand up O Jerusalem which has drunk out of the hand of the Lord the cup of his fury 
I had drunken the dregs of the cup of trembling and wronged them out. And also the, the scriptures constantly tell us to wake out out of their state. You know, because we, you know, brothers was a part, you know, these different cultures, man, these different lifestyles. You know, brothers was in the darkness, man. We was in, in some particular things, man. Okay, but the scriptures say, awake, awake. <laughs> you see? And we drunk of the cup of, of the Lord trembling through this captivity, man. You know, this is the, the, the worst captivity we've been under, under Esau Edom. And these are the results. And, and see, the the child slavery, you know, it was physically bitter. But now, the the, the, the mental slavery of our people, okay, well, they're, they're, they're on self-destruct mode, man. Death just waiting, man. No purpose, no, you know, no nothing. Niggas just, <laughs> you see? And how are these, these men able to get these guns, man? All right? But I just want to, you know, <laughs> I'm, 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 I'm I hope I get front row seats to see how these niggas react when Esau really come. When Esau come. Because they're extremely warlike and tough with each other, man. I'm anxious to see. Okay? How them same, like them same group of niggas like that, how they react when Esau spin the block. Okay? When Esau pull up. Them foreign troops pull up. You in troops pull up. <laughs> you see? <laughs> and it says, there is none. All right? To guide her among all the sons whom she have brought forth. Okay, and this is what Israel is producing because the she is speaking of Israel, man. Okay, and outside of the elect, all right, there's no guidance for our people, man. That's why the Lord raised up pastors after his own heart that what that's feeding us with knowledge and understanding. You see, because outside of that, there's no guide amongst our people. Okay? Outside the, the, the true teachings of Yahweh Bashim al Shai, our people have no true God. They're not producing any righteous leaders, man, outside of what's being birthed through Yahweh Bashim al Shai. Okay? It says, There is none to guide her among all the sons whom she have brought forth. Neither there any that taken her by the hand. Of all the sons that she had brought up. You know, this is this is what nigga culture is producing, man. Okay? I'ma walk down when I can't lie. I'ma walk down when I can't take. I'ma walk. And it's like, what's the what's the point? You know what what, what hey. Then he this nigga saying free everybody. So you see this culture put you in prison. Cause he named about 20 niggas that he won't free. You see? Nothing makes sense. <laughs> you see, no, yeah, like, what's the point? Then, <laughs> you know, and this Jake, he just waving the gun. So I guess, you know, it's, what, what's the point, man? All right, and this is the culture that our people love, and these the the niggas that Eve love. Okay, now let's go from there. You have this. Let's see. Forty-six-year-old Latasha Coleman. She was last seen on Tuesday night on Hidden Valley Lane in Hines County. She's believed to be in a 2002 gray Acura MDX, traveling in an unknown direction. If you know where she is, now it's a silver alert for a missing woman, and it's more forty-six. Okay, Eve, and she's she's the mother of niggas like that, man. Well, Shopify says you can. Okay. Now it says the Mississippi Borough investigation issued a civil alert for 46-year-old Latasha Crump Coleman of Jackson. 46-year-old? Mama ain't missing, man. Okay? 
you too old for a goddamn silver alert, man. Okay, well this is this is these are the mothers. Now let's see. She describes five foot, five feet five inches tall, weighs 180 pounds. All right, little chunky, with black braided hair and brown eyes. Coleman was last seen wearing black cut up jeans and a black shirt. Okay. <laughs> the, 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 the ripped up pants. <laughs> you see? 46, you, you still dressing like like this is this is the, the generation that the Lord Alright is gonna make a swift end of, man, because it, 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 it look look at what it's producing. Okay, and like I say she's the mother of two or three of them niggas like that. And them niggas gonna have seven or eight more of them. Okay, the Lord has to cut it off, man. All right, it will only get worse. <laughs> you see? It says, according to NBI, Coleman was last seen Tuesday, July 18, around 7.30 in the 100 block of Hidden Valley Lane in Hines County. She is believed to be in a grade 2000 Acura MDX, which has the Mississippi tag. The family member said Coleman suffers from a medical condition it may impair her judgment. It's always an excuse for Eve, man. Okay. Well, you know, she brought some little rendezvous. Okay, she pop back up, you know. And the and the Lord, you know, is is, is, is making Eve accountable lately, man. Okay, and it's gonna get worse. Let's get a few precepts, man, because as the scriptures say, this is Isaiah. One and three said the ox know his his owner and the ass is master crib. But Israel doth not know. My people doth not consider. Pete Jake doesn't even consider Yahweh Bashimal Shai. Okay? That's not a thought to a nigga, man. <laughs> you see? Jake don't care about being Israelite. Jake's Jake wanna be there forever. Like these niggas and niggas, and niggas talking about we going to take the hood to the kingdom. No, them niggas is not going to no kingdom, man. Okay? No, them niggas finna be put down. They going to have to be literally born again. Okay? E wretched ass, they going to have to be put down and literally born again. All right? Start all over, man. Okay? <laughs> Hell no. All right? And show you how foolish that long little hood demon is. The, the hood has got significantly worse, man. Significantly worse. Okay? Verse 4 says, A sinful nation, a people laden with iniquity, a seeding, all right, a seed of evildoers, and it, it's just, it's generational, man. Okay? Who you think them niggas' fathers was, man? <laughs> you see, it, 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 it's generational. Okay? Children that are corrupted, they have forsaken the Lord, they have provoked the Holy One of Israel into anger. They are gone away backward. It's getting worse. Every generation is getting farther from righteousness, man. Outside the elect whom the Lord is choosing. Okay? Each generation is getting worse and worse. And that hood culture, the hood mentality, it doesn't even make sense anymore, man. Them niggas woke up to do that. You know? It says, why should you be stricken anymore? You will revolt more and more. So the the, the, the worst conditions that the, the, the most high put niggas in, niggas don't fell in love with the punishment, man. Niggas don't fell in love with death culture. <laughs> you see? So no matter what circumstances the Lord put niggas in, man, they get worse. They they revolt more and more. You see? It, this this is a, it, this is just a culture and it's like, god damn, what's the point? You know, confusion, deception, everything is just on the increase, man. <laughs> Alright? It says the whole head is sick. And the whole heart faint, man, which is their mind. Okay? Then you have this. Let me see if I can find this. Come on, walk Let's see. 
might be on the other channel. Let me see. Including post production. <laughs> I think it was a clip with, um. <laughs> Yeah, I just um put it in a post production. All right, but you just see this picture here, okay? Just show you the hood getting worse now. Jake shouldn't be calling them out. You know why he's teaching? Cause it's just gonna cause confusion. But this is what this is what's going on now. You got them niggas, you know, doing they doing and and. and this is it. Come on, man. Uh, look at this young uh, Negro right here, man, over here looking like a damn 14 year old girl, man. Stop it, man. That's a damn shame, man. And then you got two girls with them hyping them up. That's the problem with our women right there. They talk about they want a good man, but they hype up niggas being homosexual, man. Right. Right. Does that make any damn sense? Bring your little ass across the track. I know. There you go. We right. calling our asses out. That's right. See that? Now what what produced this man? Okay. Now like I said, you know they they're not wise. My directly calling the mileage they teach. Okay, but this you do see how bad it's getting. It's only getting worse. You know, it, it, it only gets worse, man. This culture has to be. Completely rooted out the earth, man. There's a lot of Israelites that have to be deleted and put down, man, for the better good. Okay. <laughs> this is this is what is being produced, man, from that culture, man. Okay. Now, let me see. I'm... to the judgment <laughs> this is the book of generate this is the book of Jeremiah chapter 7 verse 29 and it said cut off thy hair O Jerusalem okay which is to be in mourning and cast it away and take up lamentation on high places for the Lord had rejected and forsaken the generation of his wrath Okay, so he's telling them to get ready to lament because he's going to judge, man. That forsaken generation. Okay, and we're in the midst of that forsaken generation whom the Lord is not dealing with, man. The hell with niggas, man. This this is only gets worse, man. It's a goddamn shame what niggas ha have become, what our people are becoming, man. Okay, and the leadership of the nigga woman, all right. It only gets worse, man. So, Lord will, you brothers, and you few sisters are edified till next time I say Shalom. Man, 
at this point for me, nigga, I just want something that resembles a real woman. They got the features of a real woman. So the BBL body, uh, if we go be honest, uh, nigga, that's the transsexual. They oh, got shit. to go get that done. Oh, because because when you look because the the man that want to be the woman goes and get all of that done. The natural woman don't. Yeah. The motherfucker that want to look like the woman go and get that done. So what's happening is, homie, our women feeling like they have to compete. They feeling like they gotta compete. Oh. Uh, How can I say this, homie? The drag queen used to be the drag queen because she had the eyelashes, the hair, the all the makeup, all the clothes. Nigga, now our women look like the drag queen. So the natural woman is almost as if it's a, it, it's it's like they're trying to do away with yeah, the natural that, woman. Yeah, it, it, it's 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 thing species, goddamn yeah, damn breed. It's like the natural regular pretty woman ain't beautiful no more. Yeah, Hundred years from now, I don't know what's gonna look like. It's like the normal natural pretty woman isn't beautiful anymore if she don't have the hourglass figure. The come on, homie, this Man. shit is a it, it, it's it's deception. And it's an illusion.